stopped this train, and it is currently barely full speed towards that giant pit over there. We're also crashing countless cars, blowing up thousands of sticks of real dynamite, and even putting 10 jet engines on a car. Just to show you the most insane experiments of all time, starting with filling a house with over 100,000 fireworks. Please do not try this in your house. For this experiment, each of the boys will hide a dummy in my new house to see if it's even possible to survive. Water and fire don't mix. My mannequin is going to survive. Mine's in the fridge. Go in, come on. Let's blow this house up. Hey, be careful. If you accidentally press one, the house explodes. Oh my goodness. Where's your mannequin? Bathtub. Fridge. Under the washer. Tree. Uh, front porch. Oh yeah, it's sitting right there. <laughs> this is going to be the coolest thing you have ever seen in your life. Yes! Five, four, three, two, one. I don't think our mannequins are gonna make it. The house burned down all night until there was literally nothing left, including all the mannequins. Next experiment. We're about to play tug of war between this real military tank and these two school buses. And the loser gets dragged into this pit. There's no way the tank loses. We're probably gonna lose. No, we're not. Now, obviously, people can't be in these vehicles because they'll die when they fall in the pit. So this remote actually controls the tank. This feels illegal. Great! Two, one, go! You're yours! I'm full throttled right now. You're done for! Oh! oh, we're screwed. The buses are done for. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'll turn the ball. Do you hear the bus is beeping? It's a horn is going off. We're gonna go investigate the bottom of the pit to see the buses. Oh god. Oh no. I need to stop looking down this terror. Stop moving! I'm not moving! Woo! We're in the pit. Oh my gosh. Bro, look at that. Why'd the bus think it could beat the tank? <laughs> I don't think it did. Later in this video, a train's gonna come off those tracks and land right about there. But before we do that, this is $50,000, and it is surrounded by thousands of pounds of TNT. And this is Will. What's up, guys? See that crate in the field? Yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> that is around 1% of the explosives surrounding this money. Are we safe standing here? Uh, yeah, you'll be fine. Here's my credit card. Spend as much money as you want to protect this 50 grand. I don't care if you use wood, bricks, or even steel to protect this money. Whatever is left of this 50 grand when that TNT blows up, you keep. Good luck building walls. All right, let's make $50,000. He doesn't stand a chance. The first thing Will did was buy 12 industrial water containers and fill them with 20,000 pounds of water. Bro, I'm really worried that Jimmy's TNT is gonna get through this. And he should be, because this isn't even close to enough to stop the TNT. Meanwhile, we're gonna test another experiment. In a previous video, we put a jet engine on a car and it jumped over eight buses. So this time we put 10 jet engines on the car and we're gonna see if it flies 10 times further. When this car flies off this ramp, I think it's gonna go past all the buses into the trees. I think it's gonna hit the first bus. Our guesses couldn't be further <laughs> apart. He's currently matrixed into the car, so he sees what the car sees. Chris! Hey! Oh, should we move? Yeah, we're sending a rocket car. Oh, okay. Three, two, one, send the jet car! Car is coming straight at us. I lost signal. Maybe we should jump. Yeah, I'm straight, man. Yeah. Oh my God! Yeah! What the heck? Whoa! Wait, wait! We broke the ramp. I think it was a success. Yes. The jet car easily cleared all 12 buses and literally left a crater in the road. I love how this block of engines just on the road. Yeah, it's still smoking. Whoa! Oh, like, oh and smoke. And now we are back at the giant pit. If you jump in this deep pit and land on a thousand bouncy balls, would you die? I'd love to know. Oh, the cat! Catch what? What are we doing? Goodbye. Oh! You 
completely missed! Luckily, we have more mannequins. Will it survive? Heads, heads, heads! Ah! Jimmy, what if we drop the car on it? I think you know what's about to happen. It worked! No! Clearly that mannequin didn't survive. Next bit. Meanwhile, Will was desperately trying to protect his $50,000. He's honestly taking this way more seriously than I thought he would. In the past four days, I've hired some professionals and we've already built the cinder block wall, filled it with matches, and we're already on our second cinder block wall. This dynamite is not getting through. You blew my expectations out of the water. How about this? If you let me double the TNT, I'll double the money. So 100 grand, double the TNT. Yeah, but if it blows it up, you get nothing. Take the deal, take the deal. Okay. Deal, baby. Okay. Deal, baby. And while he kept working, the boys and I went bowling. And the bowling balls are these cars. I'm ready to see some destruction. Let's see if I get a strike. Oh. Hey, first bowl strike. Oh, it's not going straight. Oh, it's coming our direction. Oh. We should move. We should move. We should move. Nolan, watch out! Oh! Into the field. There it goes. Oh, it's turning around. Oh, it's coming back. Oh, God. It's coming back. The car's got a mind of its own. It's coming back. Take number two. Oh, that's a perfect strike. I love cars hitting things. And if you're wondering, the other car is still going in circles. During this bit, me and the boys have been wearing some brand new designs, which you can now buy on our new store, MrBeast.store. Three, two, one. We switched from shopmrbeast.com, which was very long, move over, move over, to MrBeast.store. Oh my God. Oh, no way. Oh, we just about died. I'm going to show you how to just hit a full strike. Easy. Okay. All right, here comes the strike, baby. A dot store domain is the perfect choice for anyone looking to sell anything online. That was the worst throw yet. That was the best throw yet. It was awesome. If you're looking to set up a store, it should be a dot store domain. So your customers clearly know that your website is a store. This is Carl's car. Unlike .com, MrBeast.store tells the world that the website is my store. Don't forget to head to MrBeast.store and buy our brand new merch right now. Since I doubled Will's money and TNT, he's completed a seven layer fortress of 20,000 pounds of water, mattresses, a cinder block wall, four mattresses, a second cinder block wall, an additional 32,000 pounds of water, all packed in with a final wall of dirt. But I actually have another layer that Jimmy knows nothing about. Jimmy? We'll never see this one coming. What? Hey, Jimmy! How am I supposed to blow up Feastables? That's the point. And with the TNT doubled, it's time to put Will's bunker to the test. I also brought number 40 from 1 through 100 back to help us blow up all this TNT. You're in charge of the button. Don't press anything yet. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Moment of truth. Whenever you're ready, press the one. I'm nervous. I can't even see anything. Is it okay? What? I think I see money falling from the sky. No. Seven days of work just went up in flames. I don't know if I've got this. I gotta see if my money's okay. Why are we running? I'm running because he's running. Oh my goodness. Oh, there's so many stacks. We counted out the money and over $95,000 survived the explosion. I just won $95,000. Congrats on the 95 grand. Let's go see what happens if you drive a train into a pit. Yeah. All been waiting for. A train is gonna go full speed down those tracks into this giant pit. If you were on this train, where would you sit? I put my mannequin in the cabin. Statistically, the safest place to be on a train. All right, we got this. All right, we're gonna sit him right on the front. You're not going anywhere. Where do you get the Feastables bar? A front row seat. Stop eating Hershey's. Eat Feastables. We have waited our entire lives for this moment. This is going to be epic. Nolan, send the train. The train's coming. Let's do this. Here it goes! Oh my god! Here it comes!
That might have been the coolest thing I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> You're kidding me? Yeah, my mannequin didn't survive. Train versus pit, the pit one. I hope you enjoyed the video. Let's end it with an explosion. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God.